Ever wondered what life would be like on Jupiter? Let's take an imaginary trip to the biggest planet in our solar system. But spoiler alert, you might want to pack a very, very strong umbrella. First off, there's a small problem. You can't actually stand on Jupiter. It's a gas giant, made mostly of hydrogen and helium. So there's no solid ground to build your dream house on. It's more like a giant cosmic cloud. If you tried to land, you'd just sink deeper and deeper into its dense atmosphere. Speaking of the atmosphere, it's intense. The pressure is over a thousand times what we experience on Earth. It would be like being at the bottom of the deepest ocean, but everywhere. And the winds, they are absolutely wild, whipping around at over 300 miles per hour. That's faster than the most powerful hurricanes on Earth. But let's imagine we could build a floating city. A bit like something out of a sci-fi movie, bobbing in the upper layers of Jupiter's atmosphere. What would the view be like? Simply spectacular. You'd see swirling clouds of ammonia ice and incredible patterns, creating colorful bands of white, orange, brown, and red. And you'd have to get used to a very short day. Jupiter spins incredibly fast, completing a full rotation in just under 10 hours. So it would be day, then night, then day again. All before your Earth workday is even over. But the years a long run trip around the sun for Jupiter. Takes almost 12 Earth years. And then there's the great red spot. This isn't a tourist destination. It's a colossal storm, bigger than our entire planet, that has been raging for centuries. Living anywhere near it would be, well, let's just say, a bit turbulent. So, while the idea of living on Jupiter is fascinating, with its strange physics and breathtaking, chaotic beauty, it seems Earth is the perfect home for us. It is solid ground, breathable air, and much calmer weather. It really makes you appreciate our beautiful blue planet, doesn't it? What planet should we explore next? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching, and if you enjoyed this cosmic journey, don't forget to like and subscribe for more adventures through space. See you next time.